And now let's talk about a different kind of war. It is sweeping the global tech space, being fought by the titans of the industry, the likes of Microsoft, Apple, Amazon, and Meta. They're fighting to dominate a new frontier, artificial intelligence. It's the next big thing. AI-based technology will shape the next decade, and big tech wants to lead this race. Take the case of Apple. Apple has not released any major AI features on its devices. You could say Apple is lagging behind. But behind the scenes, it is making aggressive moves. Apple is talking to Google to use Google's AI program called Gemini. It may be installed in the next iPhone. And in China, Apple is exploring a similar deal with Baidu. That's the Chinese search giant engine. Baidu, it's like China's Google. Why does Apple need it? Because Western tech products do not work in China. So for the Chinese market, you need Chinese AI. And Baidu could provide that to Apple. Now, some reports say the deal is already done and that Apple plans to launch the iPhone 16 soon. The Chinese version of this device will have Baidu's AI bot. It's called Ernie. So Apple is betting on partners to launch AI-based features. It is also building its own capabilities. In the last one year, Apple has bought some 32 AI companies. They've bought 32 companies. Why build from scratch when, when you can just go out and buy? So Apple is on a buying spree. It has acquired more AI companies than any other tech player. Let me show you some numbers. In 2023, Meta, the parent company of Facebook, bought 18 AI-based companies. Microsoft acquired 17 companies, and Apple took over 32. And there was no fire sale here. These numbers just show how desperate the big players are. They're investing heavily in artificial intelligence and buying firms left, right, and center. Another example is retail giant Amazon. It is consolidating its AI investments. It's pouring big money into a company called Anthropic. It's a startup. It's a rival of ChatGPT. Amazon had investments in Anthropic. Now it is adding another $2.75 billion. So Amazon's total investment in this company will be $4 billion. And this is the trend. AI companies are the hottest thing right now. They're raising big money, mostly from big tech. Let me show you another list of the major AI companies and their big tech investors. OpenAI tops this list. That is the maker of ChatGPT, OpenAI. It has raised $13 billion from Microsoft and its rival, from Microsoft, that's where they've got this money from. OpenAI has got $13 billion. Their rival is Anthropic, the company I just told you about. It's got $4 billion from Amazon, plus it has investments from Google and Salesforce. Put together, Anthropic has raised some $7.25 billion. Third on our list is a company called Databricks. Again, they work in the AI space. You may not, ha not have heard of this company, but for some reason, Databricks excites big tech a lot. Do you know how many big investors it has? At least five. NVIDIA, Microsoft, Salesforce, Google, Amazon, all of these companies have put money in Databricks. Again, this is big money, which begs the question, why is big tech pouring so much money into AI companies? Why are they making multiple acquisitions? You could say they're hedging their bets. It's not clear what's coming next or who will develop it. So they're casting a wide net, building a foundation to develop better AI products instead of having to start from scratch. That's one reason. The other is the dearth of talent. You see, the AI talent pool is quite limited. So if you cannot get people, you buy the companies they're working for. Look at what Mark Zuckerberg is up to. He's personally poaching engineers. Reports say Zuckerberg is writing personal letters to AI engineers at Google. In some cases, Meta is not even interviewing these candidates. They're being hired straight away. Clearly, good AI talent is scarce. So big tech giants are absorbing the best talent through the back door. It's good for the employees. They'll get bigger paychecks. But this rapid consolidation may also hurt the industry in the long term. It may put all the AI technology in the hands of a few entities, and big tech is already too powerful. Artificial intelligence will only amplify their dominance.